another vlog. I know I haven't vlogged in a long, long time, but I'm here again. Today's vlog, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys some of the stuff that I got from the off shop or what we call the ukai ukai here in Australia. So for you guys who didn't know, I really love to go buy stuff from the ukai ukai or from the off shop because first one, it's cheap. Second one, it's so good to use stuff you know that you didn't pay much for it and I think I got that from my mom because she <laughs> loves to buy stuff from Ukai Ukai back home and I don't usually buy stuff at the mall or like branded stuff when I was growing up. In Australia, the op shop, uh, we call it op shop, are the things that people donate and the proceeds of that will go to a charity. There are a lot of stuff that you can find in the op shop from clothes to furniture, name it. Everything is in there. And our house is just close to two op shops, the Salvos and the Savers. So I really have, you know, some spare times to go in there and check what's in there. What I'll be showing with you guys today are bags that I feel like you would love. I thought I got from the op shop. For disclaimer, this is not everything that I got because some of the stuff that I bought, I already sent back home. And yeah, without further ado, I'm gonna share with you guys some stuff that I got from the off shop. We'll be starting with wallets. So the first one is this Michael Kors wallet. It's the legit Michael Kors, as you can see here. The Zippo. So Monisha, guys. And inside, it's still so good. I feel like the owner of this just used this once or twice, but I got it for seven dollars, a price of a bubble tea. <laughs> so it's a really, really cheap and so, so nice. And the next one is a wallet again. Oh my god, this is a Chanel, a vintage wallet, a vintage Chanel wallet. And I don't know if it's original or not. But it has the logo of the Chanel here and here also. And Chanel inside. Oh my god, I'm so sorry for my nails. I actually got some acrylic nails before and I took them off by myself. It hurts so bad. But anyways, don't judge me. So this is a Chanel wallet that I bought from the off shop as well. So I think I got this. See? There's Chanel logos inside. I think I got this for nine bucks. I'm not sure. Probably in that range. Nine less than ten dollars. So this is so cute. And the next one will be moving forward for bags. Mini bags. This is a black baguette bag. So karon also niyang baguette bags as you can see some mga, you know, street styles, uso kayang inaning a bag. You can pair this with jeans and shirts and everything and it will look so good with any outfit. So this is for $6, I think I got this for $6. And I'm actually gonna be sending this back home and I'm gonna give this to my best friend. Shout out to Eva May. Hi girl, this is your bag. See, this is so cute. It's a leather black baguette bag. The brand is Zoo. I'm not sure what brand is this, but it's brandless. But so cute. Mahal na siya kapalit ng Zafinas. So, the next one is also a baguette bag. This is a different one from the first one that I show you guys. This also is a baguette one, but the strap is white. And there is a style on here. And I hope there's still some papers inside. But, yep. This is also a baguette bag, so okay, gapon kay ni siya sa any outfits. It, and also less than 10 bucks, so okay na kayo. And the next one is one of my favorites. I've been using these hips now when I go out and I just have to bring a card and a phone with me. So this is a guest baguette bag. And you can't see this anymore sa ilang mga new designs. Because okay, this is actually a vintage guess baguette bag. And what I love about this bag is it can fit my phone, it can fit my card holder, I can put keys, my mask, and some sanitizers. And the details 
are so so cool like you can see here the buttons are gas gas and it's such it's such a nice baguette bag vintage baguette bag and like mm, you could never i think i'm gonna be using this for a long long time because i really really love it moving on we will go to sling bags so the first sling bag that I'm gonna be showing with you guys is a black Mimco sling bag. I got it for $10, it's Unsavers, and Mimco is actually an Australian brand. And the retail price of Mimco, if you buy a brand new one, would range from $100 up. So I got this for $10, so it's actually really, really good price now. So, how much you guys? Simple the shag design. I'm so sorry. I look so bad, but anyways, so simple the shag design. So you can fit this, you know, pag maglakaw ka, you just want to bring some few stuffs with you. And I don't want to show you the inside of this. I just used this a few weeks ago, but don't judge me. Don't judge me. T-shirt and a mask. I'm gonna clean this one. Don't worry. So yeah, this is actually a mimco bag. The next one is. A sling bag as well, but this is a Gucci sling bag. This is not legit. I'm not. I know it's not. Kai yahang strap na wala na kolo. Pero for the price, I bought this for less than ten dollars. Ma ilad, ma ilad na siya ugtaw guys. Kano mga ilad ilad na lang good no? <laughs> oh, is your pack original or not? Nah, they won't care. So, this is actually a Gucci light brown sling bag. I used it. Yay, thank you, Limpish. <laughs> so, the inside has this logo of Gucci, but I'm sure, I'm sure it's not original. Though, it's Gucci yang yang zipo. I'm sure it's not original. Gabi na kaya mga replication karon guys. You can't differentiate the original from the fake ones, kay. It's so so good na. They can ilad people already. And the next one is a guess vintage sling bag. See, look at that. And the details. It's so good. It's so cute. It's still so nice. Leather, nice. It's. In a pristine condition, and I got this for like four dollars. And yep, this actually for my cousin at the Kim. Hi, this is gonna be your bag. I'm gonna be sending this together with the baguette bag. So some of the bags here I'm gonna be selling. So if you like it, just DM me, guys. But in forward, may mo na kung online seller charot lang. Moving on, we will go to handbags. So this is for mom, mga office people. This is a Kate Spade black. Uh, shoulder bag. I'm not sure what kind of leather is this, but it is still so nice, so so good, still in pristine condition. And as you can see inside, it's color pink, but I don't think people will notice it if you open your bag. But you can fit so many things in this bag. So, yeah, guys, I'll be selling this bag. So, for anyone of you, who wants to ask for this bag, you can just, you know, send me a message and I'll send you details. This has the Kate Spade thing inside. This one as well. This is still so good. And I think if the re I think the retail price for Kate Spade would range from $400, probably more than 15,000 pesos. So I bought this for less than twenty dollars, so I'm gonna be selling this with, for a friendly price as well. So DM me, guys. I'll be sending you pictures if you will send me a message. Thank you. The last, uh, what do you call it? Shoulder bag that I'll be showing you guys is a coach. Ooh. A coach shoulder bag. The only thing that I don't like about this is the color inside. It's blue, but it has the coach logo, which, you know, people said the Mogin ang ilhanan nga original siya. So the logo inside. And it has this thing in the handle. The coach na logo. And this. And here. 
to close and open one but for this pocket here i'm sorry so you have a little pocket here and yeah it's not as big as a kate spade but you can also fit a few stuffs here this is also for sale guys the yummy <laughs> and for the last one ladies and gentlemen drum roll please i'm joking this is i think the best purchase that i bought from the op shop or the ukai ukai i've used this and the people were like oh my god oh my god and the moment i saw this i was like oh my god i couldn't even speak i was just blown away with the bag that i saw i instantly bought it and i've been using it and i think it's gonna be the love of my life I'm sorry boyfriend, but anyways, this is a Chanel shoulder bag. Ah, I've, I've sent a picture of this to my cousin and she said that she feel like it's legit. Though I don't want to disappoint myself, so sometimes I put in my mind that it's not original or stuff, but I don't care. I don't care if it's original or not. But. So my cousin sent me a link to how to differentiate original Chanel bag to the fake one and the mga details na belong to original but I don't know, I don't know but you guys will I'll have you guys decide you can see the Chanel one here the steel is pretty pretty good it's not like the fake siya. The, the quality you can't really tell if it's fake and got Chanel here, both of the sides, and also the buttons in the sling itself. Got this Chanel logo. And one thing I'm looking at the original is here. I checked inside, and there is this serial number. And I don't know if you can see it, but there is a two Chanel logo and a number, a serial number. And I typed it in Google, and the number nigawas ang exact picture sa bag. So maodo na ang ilhag ng original ang isa pa bag. But I don't know, guys. I'm no expert, but I think this bag will always be my first baby, and I will always be having this on my closet for a long, long time. So hindi siya palikyan. So sorry, guys. So. Oh my god! I hope that you liked the video. I hope that you like the bags that I bought from the op shop or the ukai ukai. That's it, guys. I hope that I can still do make another video after this because I haven't been vlogging in a long, long time. I was busy with school and other stuff, and it's been hard with the lockdown and everything. But I hope you guys are hanging well. I hope you guys are healthy and happy because that's what matters the most. And I hope that you know this will be soon over and we can go back to normal and i can go home because i don't want to cry but i really miss my family i hope this will be over in god's time so thank you guys for watching i hope that you will still support me after this vlog i know it's a lame one but i've been wanting to share with you guys some bags that i got from the off shop because i feel like you know mga babay din ha will like it. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time. I love you all.